Hi everyone. So today is nine days past trigger, I think. Yeah, nine days, seven, eight, nine. So um, I did take a test again, um, but I just want to um, clarify why the tests are positive because some people are like, oh my god, it's positive, and they're like getting all excited for me. But the reason why they're positive right now is because I took the HCG trigger shot um, nine days ago now. And what I'm doing is uh, testing out the HCG trigger shot because what that shot does is it gives you a false positive because it, um, it gives your body um, the HCG or whatever. So before I start testing for my actual positive, I'm going to be testing out the shot so that I can see that it's um, negative and then if it gets to be a positive after that, then I know it's a true positive. Um, and usually uh, the HCG shot is out by 10 days for some people. Um, so this is the one that I took today. It is a lot lighter than the two previous ones that I did. So it is coming out of my system finally. And I'll show you the tests together. This lighting is really bad. I'm going to try taking the flash off, see if that's better, it's a little better, so you can see that's dark, that's, um, people were saying it looks a little lighter, um, I mean in person I can't really tell the difference, but on camera you can tell that that first one's a little darker, that one's a little lighter, and then this one is a lot lighter, there's still a line but it's a lot lighter. So I think what I'm going to do is skip tomorrow because I only have two tests left, um, which I'll probably buy more, but for now I'm going to skip tomorrow, which is cycle day, I mean cycle day, um, post trigger shot day 10 tomorrow um, because according to today's test, tomorrow is either going to be uh, negative or still slightly positive like a faint line so I'll skip that day and go with two days from now and then I'll test then and let you guys know what happens after that every time I finish the video I always um, remember things that I was supposed to say and right now I can't think of anything um, there was a comment though of, of um, it was kind of a critique, but like after I watched my video back, I realized that I actually do that. I smack my lips when I talk. I don't think I do this in, in person, but when I watched the video over again, I noticed I did it. And I guess like after I stopped talking, like I do this like kind of thing with my mouth. And I did it like five times in that video and somebody said that it was really, really annoying. And I agree, like I was super embarrassed watching it back because that is pretty irritating. But I don't realize that I do that, so I'm going to try not to do it. I probably did do that in this video. I just, I, I don't even realize I'm doing it. So I'm going to try not to. Every time I stop talking, I'm going to try not to do that with my mouth. Um, I'm sorry if that bugs you, um, but I don't mean to do it. Uh, so yeah, that's it. And, oh my gosh, I just did it. See? That is so weird. Okay, I'm just going to cut this video now. <laughs> and I'll let you guys know what's going to happen in two days. Uh, I've been really busy with work, so I haven't yet gone to my fertility doctor. Um, they're supposed to do blood work to see if I've ovulated. And then a week after that, they do um, the pregnancy test. So they're supposed to see if I ovulated now. 
but I'm just too busy with work to go and do that. So I'll probably skip it and just go in for the pregnancy test next week. Yeah, I'll probably do that. Uh, so that's it, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.